Well, in just a matter of hours, gun rights advocate Adam Kokish could get out of jail. That's right. He appeared in court not too long ago, and a judge agreed to give him bond, but it's still unclear what will happen next. Our Brianne Carter explains. Gun activist Adam Kokish could be out of jail as early as this afternoon, but it's unclear if he'll actually leave. This morning, a judge set a $5,000 bond, but he also told Kokish he couldn't possess or live in a house with guns until his case is finished. His roommates, who legally own guns, say they won't be surprised if he decides to stay behind bars. We're not thinking he's going to want to post bond, uh, probably A, because of the stipulations, and uh, B, because he's probably going to you know, try to stay and make a statement. Last week, Park Police raided Kokish's Herndon home. Today in court, prosecutors claim 10 guns were found inside a safe in the home, along with hallucinogenic mushrooms. The search at the home was in response to this video posted on YouTube. We will not allow our government to destroy our humanity. In it, Kokish is seen loading what appears to be a shotgun in Freedom Plaza, which is illegal in D.C. Park police say their investigation is still ongoing. Meanwhile, Kokish's roommates say no matter what Kokish decides, they'll continue to push the message. It's not about Adam, it's about this message, it's about the people, it's about our constitution, it's more than just gun rights, it's about civil liberty. We do know Kokish will be back before a judge October 2nd for a preliminary hearing. In Fairfax, Breanne Carter, ABC 7 News.